Hey everybody, Shoebox Legends here. Thanks for joining me today. We are here with official assistant to the channel, Leo, who is uh, hanging out in his back of the couch, like nest area that he created. He likes to sit back here during the day, stare down the street and wait for uh, Mrs. Shoebox Legends to arrive at home. So I've joined him out here this afternoon and we're just gonna take a quick rip through a couple of packs of Fleer Ultra Series 2 baseball from 1993. Leo likes the foily wrapper here, seems to be a fan. Um, have got these, I got these actually as a contest prize win very early in my days on YouTube. I'm just gonna crack these a little because they kind of stick together. Uh, from Tony Black, so won his, uh, a subscriber contest that he had going on and got a wax box of this stuff and uh, haven't ripped through any packs in a while, so figured I would grab a couple here and take a look with my man, Leo. So, uh, good, I'm gonna move this pack here. Oh boy, we're, we're uh, operating in some tight quarters today, so we may see, uh, whoops, the phone take a spill here, we'll see. But a uh, nice card out of the gate with a Wade Boggs. Gotta love that. Uh, I think Leo's a fan of that. We got a Juan Guzman of the World Series champion in 1993, Toronto Jays. Kevin Apier with the Royals. Oof, the glare's pretty bad here today. Mike Felder. We got a Greg Briley. Florida Marlins there. Nice early teal Marlins jersey look there. Uh, I think we got a card stuck to the back of Greg Briley. Yep. Oh, Leo is impressed. Carlos Hernandez. Backstop for the Dodgers. Getting the smell treatment and I think maybe a kiss there. That was very polite. We got Ryan Bowen. So a Marlins heavy pack here for sure. Uh, he seems to be stuck to a Sherman Obando. Uh, I've been collecting cards for a long time and I like to think I have a pretty good Memory, I, I do not recall Sherman Obando at all. I question how many other Major League cards this guy actually has. Uh, here's another card of a Marlins backstop, Steve Decker. Yeah, a lot of Marlins. I, I'm guessing Series 2 is probably heavy on the Marlins. Uh, we got a Jim Converse here for Seattle. And of course, this has the great foil rookie ribbon that was such a big deal back in the early 90s with Ultra Products. Another catcher, Mike McFarlane. Mike Moore. And last but not least, Steve Cook, also sporting the foil ultra rookie ribbon. We'll let Leo have that one for his, his PC. What do you think, buddy? Um, kind of a dud of a pack there. I think series two is not exactly chock full of star power. Um, Wade Boggs, I'd say, was the, the highlight of the first pack, um, just having been traded from the Red Sox to the Yankees, he made Series 2. And let's open the second pack here, give it a little flex. I don't know if you guys do that or not. I, I've had decent luck with flexing my packs here uh, with this older stuff that kind of sticks together. Tends to separate them pretty well without really badly damaging the cards. I've also heard putting cards in the freezer works. I don't know if anyone can confirm or deny that in the comments below. I've never tried it myself, but it's a method I've heard of others using. And wow, look at this. I should have taken out some penny sleeves, but this is definitely gonna be the card of today's brief rip. The Griffey Jr. Ultra All-Star Insert. So there weren't many better cards as far as inserts that you could have pulled back then than Griffey. I mean, I, I still get excited when I pull a Griffey insert today. Um, I, I don't know too many people that didn't like collecting this guy back in the 90s, and uh, that is a card that I definitely don't have. I recognize by uh, by sight that I don't have that one, and that's going straight into my PC. And we follow that up with the Hawk Andre Dawson, uh, Dawson, a Hall of Fame Red Sox card. So a blistering start to pack two after kind of a dud first pack outside of Wade Boggs. We got Jimmy Key, and uh, Leo is back to uh, watching down the street for Mrs. Shoebox Legends. He is uh, much more a fan of her than he is of uh, sports cards. Here is a Daryl Kyle, who sadly passed away in a plane crash, if I recall correctly. Uh, Darren Holmes with the Rockies. 
who were a new franchise in 93, of course, along with the Marlins. Here's Jeff Montgomery. Trevor Wilson with the Giants. Great. I love the clear photography here. These cards were really, really beautiful for 1993. I mean, these are coming up on 30 years old now, and they still look very crisp. Uh, Greg Swindell. We got Steve Howe of the Evil Empire. Luis Rivera, two Red Sox cards in this pack. Good stuff there. We got Randy Myers with the Cubs. Andy Ashby. Milt Thompson, and we close it out with Tommy Shields, rookie for the Chicago Cubs. And that's a wrap. I would definitely say the second pack was the better of the two. And I would uh, definitely say that this Ken Griffey Jr. all-star insert is uh, heads and tails the best card that we pulled here today. So uh, thanks again. Uh, I don't know if you'll see this, but thanks again to Tony Black for the awesome prize package and uh really happy with uh how this pack went this is a griffey that will be an absolute keeper for me and uh thank you also to leo for your help today you did a great job as usual uh no barking no no issues so a uh, nice job being a calm dude for this installment of ripping with leo and uh to everybody else i appreciate you stopping by and spending a few minutes with us and uh we'll certainly be back in the near future with some more sports card content until then take care